Bella, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome to my channel. I like to talk about fashion, my life, and more fashion, so if that's something that you like to hear a lot about, which I like to hear a lot about, you should probably just go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below already because it's about to be a bomb video. It's the end of August. We're getting there. We're getting closer. I know nobody likes to talk about it. School's about to be back in session. School might also already be back in session for you, and for that, I'm so sorry. I'm just gonna show you everything that I got. Um, my parents bought mm, like 90% of this, so thank you, mom and dad. My new style that I've like come up with in my head that I like think is gonna be really cute is like preppy how I am right now. So like Bella King, Blair Waldorf, plus e-girl, plus hype beast, plus Instagram. Yeah, but only like in black. So I don't know, we'll see how that goes. I tried to like kind of accomplish that through some of the things that I bought. For this haul, I went to a lot of different places. I went to H&M, Forever 21, Nordstrom, and then I thrifted a lot of the stuff too, just because <laughs> sustainability, we love that. I'm just gonna get into it, show you all these clothes. So the first store I'm gonna talk about for the stuff that I got is H&M. I got this divided dress, it's an off the shoulder dress, it's just straight across, and then it has these little like, it's not ruffles, but it's like pulled tighter. Anyway, it's a nice long sleeve, it's super comfy, it's ribbed. I think this is going to be like a new Saturday morning kind of dress. Like my Saturday dress is like my version of like a hoodie because it's cotton. It's really soft and like it's cute. It's so cute. Like I can wear it to class and stuff, but like I have a feeling that's where this is gonna be. The next thing from H&M is this like long midi black dress. It's cute. It's a button up dress. I don't usually get long dresses because I'm short lol so um yeah five feet tall plus like long things don't really look good it just makes me look shorter and i don't like it surprisingly shook because it actually looks cute obviously it's why i bought it i wouldn't buy it if it looked ugly on the top half it gives me like made vibes low key because of like how the shoulders are and you can't like button it all the way up but i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna pin it all the way up so that it's like at the neck like does that make sense like when you button a shirt all the way up to the top like where the collar is like i'm gonna button it all the way up there so it's like a whole like thing and then you could put a necklace under the lapel like that's what i think i'm gonna do so yeah i'm branching out you know i said i'm changing my style so like i'm branching out final h&m purchase is this black and white gingham pattern and it like flares out at the waist it's a cute dress but yo it's in a size two and you know i was really shocked because i was at the store and it was on sale and i was like "Ooh, this is cute and so i grabbed a zero and a two and i do that because you know sometimes things fit sometimes things don't fit the zero bro the zero fit me except in the chest area. I was shook because this is a button up dress. So like, you know, girls, you know what the situation is. Like if you button something like it fits everywhere except for the top half, you gotta go size up. So that is what I did. I'm shook. Yeah, I really like this dress. Um, I'm just, I, I like it. I just feel like this is kind of my vibe and like it's still in the black and white like realm. So like I'm a fan. Moving on. So the next store I went to is Forever 21 and I got a couple things like this super sheer shirt with like a ruffled front and it's a button up, like literally it is see-through. But I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have like a camisole underneath or I'm gonna go to Forever 21 and get one of their like cropped camisoles and put that underneath so that it can be like flowy on top but then tight under, right? Like that seems like such a cute idea. I don't know, I just really like this skirt. Shirt, skirt, shirt, it's a shirt. Next thing from Forever 21 is this cropped like v-neck long sleeve top or whatever. I have a couple of deep v-neck shirts also from Forever 21. So, you know, Forever 21's branding, I guess this is just what I buy from them. Yeah, this isn't really for school. This is a going out top. I just put this here because, you know, I got it when I was back to school shopping and like I'm gonna use it while I'm at school, I'm just not gonna wear it to school, you know what I mean? This is for going out. This is for having a good time. This is not for 8 a.m math section. I need to get a few more shirts like this because every time me and my friends try to get dressed to go out, I never have any clothes and I always have to borrow stuff from people because I just don't have any outfits for stuff like that. So I decided to, you know, help myself out. The last thing I got from Forever 21 also is just not for school because lol, there's no way. Fashion week is coming up. For me, it's gonna be like the second week of school, so I need stuff to wear, and I've worn pretty much everything in every Instagram picture ever, so I need something different. So I got this, like, <laughs> look at that, that's so fun. It's like a bralette 
fringe top. Very excited to wear this out. It's not gonna be that cold in early September. It'll still pretty much be summertime, so that's good, so I won't literally be dying. But this shirt's, I'm really excited about this shirt. I don't know what day this is gonna be for. I don't know what I'm wearing this with. I don't even know. But you know, I was like, girl, do something a little different. So I decided to do something a little different. I did say that I was gonna do some more like hype beast Instagram baddie. And I feel like this is, it's not hype beast, but this is definitely Instagram baddie. Yeah, you'll probably just see it on my Instagram and that'll probably be the end of it because this is really a one wear kind of situation if you know what I mean. Right, so the next stuff I'm about to show you is stuff that like I didn't get from one store. It's like multiple stores, so. Let's go. So the next thing that I got is from Express. It's a nice white sweater with um, holes everywhere. So it's like got that Yeezy deconstructed vibe. I've never owned anything like this before and I don't really know what I'm gonna do. It was kind of like impulsive. I just wanted it, but it's a sweater. So I'm gonna get to use that, but it does have holes in it. So like practicality level is meh. This is just going to be, you know, temporary, but it has some nice like zippers on the side, which will probably get covered up by any skirt that I wear, but like, mm, it's some cute hardware anyway. But I just like the color, you know, white. The neckline is a little different. I don't really have any not high neck sweaters, so that's gonna be fun. I think I'm probably just gonna end up wearing this with a black skirt or something, but it's really cute. Yeah, it's just, it's just like for funsies, so it's for fun. Next top I got is from Zara. It's like this gothic looking short sleeve chiffon blowy blouse, but like the see-through like lace I think is what really caught my attention. And then that coupled with the high neck, it just seems very elegant to me. So I'm like, I'm living for that and it's black. So like we're in my color wheel. So yeah, I got this top. I feel like I'm just gonna end up wearing it like I wear everything, which is just with a skirt. I feel like I'm gonna wear a lot of black on black outfits unless I get more skirts that are like gray. And I feel like that's a lot because this gives me a little bit of funeral vibes, but it is what it is. The next thing I got is from Windsor. It's a nice cap sleeve dress. Bro, it is short. I mean, like, you know when you like pick something up on a hanger and you're like, oh, like this is so cute. It's like a little short, but like I tried it on, bro, it is so short. I'm just a little shook. But I think it fits me really well, especially on the waist and like the length works. And like I've been trying to get a little bit shorter things because I feel like all of my skirts are insanely long for how tall I am. Like I'm five feet tall and I like wear skirts that end right above the knee and I'm just like, I don't have to adhere to a dress code anymore. I'm so confused. So I'm just gonna, you know, do what I want. The next thing I got is from Boohoo. It is this orange velvet skater skirt. You know, this is the only colorful thing that I've really got for this entire haul that's not in my color range. And I don't know why I got it, but it just gave me like 70s vibes. Like there's so much fabric in it that it just hangs a little different than a normal like cotton skater skirt from Forever 21. It's a little different. I really like the texture. I've never had an orange skirt before because I just don't buy orange because well, like this is fun. I can do little cute circles in it and like I feel like a princess. So like that's the bonus. That is literally why I got the skirt. Next few things got from Nordstrom. These shorts are from BB. They're like crossed in the front and then like normal shorts in the back. They're like pleather, but also not really. I don't really know how to explain it. They're fun and they're super cute. And I feel like they go with my new aesthetic, which is Blair Waldorf vibes, preppy, Instagram hype beast, e-girl baddie. But yeah, I'm a general fan of these shorts. I just really like how the front looks and that's literally the reason I got them is because the front looks really cute. Next thing I got is this sweater. It is cashmere and it is bright red. It is a v-neck, which I don't really have many of. I don't know, I've just never been into v-necks that much. Just kind of avoid them because I prefer my sweaters to be a high neckline. This is really cute. It's super soft, it's super warm. I'm very excited to wear it. I feel like 30 degree weather who? Because I am not gonna be cold this time around. We're very excited about that. I really like this sweater a lot. So, yay, sweater, yay. I'm just gonna see what I'm gonna wear with. Probably a skirt because LOL, I'm not buying pants, so. It's so soft, oh my God, it's so soft. Like I'm holding it in my hands and I'm just stroking it because literally it's so soft. I'm gonna be so warm gonna be so warm I'm excited so the rest of the clothes in this haul is thrifted because I'm trendy I'm sustainable oh. so 
I picked out a couple things that I liked and I love it. So the first thing I got is this like black A-line skirt. The brand is Moda. I really like how it fits on. What I think I'm gonna do though is get some hem tape and hem it up maybe one inch just so that it fits better on me. I think lengthwise, like it would look so much more like stylish and cute if it was just a smidge shorter. So I do have hem tape and when I get back to school, I'm just gonna do that and I feel like that's gonna make it look really, really nice. So the next thing I got is this ribbed um, black striped red sweater. Like you can't really see the stripes, but like I swear they're there. The brand is Derek Hart. It's a basic sweater. It is a turtleneck, which I like because like I said, I like high neck sweaters because I just feel better in them. So probably just gonna wear this basic, you know, with everything else I'm wearing probably. Next thing I got is not so much of a fashion purchase, so much as just like I need this in my life. So that's helpful for me. I got a rain jacket um, in black brand is, I don't even know. So it's just a black rain jacket. I already have a black rain jacket and it has fur lining, but like that's for the winter time, you know, like this is super nice, this is super compact. Like I can roll it up into a little ball and I'm not even trying, like I love that for me. It is what it is. Next thing I got is a button front khaki uh, skirt with two pockets in the front. Brand is Cotton Candy. It's corduroy, which is cute. I used to have two skirts that were corduroy and khaki and button in the front and had pockets in the front. Like one had pockets in the front, one had buttons in the front. So I found one that matched them together and it actually fits me this time because both of those skirts were too big. So I couldn't wear those. I got a skirt finally that had all those attributes in one and actually fits me. Last two clothing items are coats. So this is just like a basic black, like chevron patterned coat. And it's gonna be a staple in my coat collection. Next coat is a like plaid patterned basic coat. It's double breasted and the buttons are so cute and like big. The sleeves are three quarters which is interesting because like a winter jacket, like you're trying to be warm, but also the realty is that you could just get those like long gloves that like go down all the way to here and like put those there and then the sleeves won't get in the way of those. And I have a pair of gloves like that. I'm excited to see how those gloves go with this coat. And I like how the buttons go all the way to the throat so you can literally like stay the most warm that you possibly can be. Finally, to complete my e-girl like aesthetic, I got something super trendy. I got a seatbelt belt from Pretty Little Things. So literally I was on Amazon and I didn't want to get the like heavy duty one that all the boys on TikTok have. So I was like, ooh, let me get like um like a less expensive and less committing version of that. So I got myself a seatbelt belt. I really love this belt. Like it is my new favorite accessory. I've been wearing it all summer since I got it with the last like two weeks I've been wearing it since I've had it, whatever. And I'm gonna wear it with almost every dress. But I am ready to wear this every day because I love it so much. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching my back to school haul. I don't really do that many hauls because I don't like shop in bulk. Who like actually shops in bulk? I don't know. But tell me which pieces were your favorite. Are you going back to school? When are you going back to school? Because I know where I live, like in Georgia, some people are already back at school, but thankfully, cause I'm in college, I don't have to go back for another week. I'm really just giving myself this like little time vacation because I just need to rest. I don't need this in my life, I need to rest. Let me know when you guys are going back to school. Do you guys go back to school shopping? Like how close to school do you go back to school shopping? Like what is the tea? Because this is only my second year doing a back to school shop. When in reality, I just like shop throughout the year. So like, why am I going back to school shopping? But like, it's fine. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to like the video and don't forget to subscribe so you can stay notified on all of my latest uploads. And don't forget to ring that little bell down below so that you'll be the first to watch when I upload a new video. Until next time, bye. Oh.